How you doing, baseball fans? This is Ed Lucas, and I'm at Yankee Stadium for Old Timers Day. And I don't consider this man an old timer, but I know him a long time and a dear friend, Gene Michael. Gene, thanks for taking the time out. All right, thank you, Eddie. Gene, first of all, you uh, worked out the uh, mechanics for the Yankees to win a pennant in the late uh, ni- early 90s and so forth, and the late 80s. Talk about those teams and what you're doing today. Well, some of the things work out. You know, we had, we had a nice nucleus with young players. We made some moves that worked. But it came through, you know, hard work from, from uh, the Steinbrenners. And, uh, you know, George, how diligent he was in, uh, in, in working every winter. <laughs> he worked us until we had good ball clubs. Mariano Rivera. He started out as a starter and then the real even wasn't sure. You almost traded it. Talk about that. Well, we got a little lucky with the decision. We didn't know for sure how he was going to be as a bullpenner, but we thought he would hold up and last longer as a bullpenner. He was kind of thin and young, and we didn't want to take chances with him. We didn't think he could last as long as a starter. And, we, of course, we didn't have any idea he was going to be this kind of pitcher, but we thought he would be effective in the bullpen. You and I, and thanks to you, we have a G. Michael Celebrity Charity Golf Classic dinner and auction on the 24th of August. And I thank you for all the help you've given us for the benefit of St. Joseph's School for the Blind, Gene. Well, you guys do a great job. It is for a great cause. These kids need to, uh, need the help. And these players that we've asked to come there, they've been more than willing. And they've, they've done a great job. They did it last, the last couple of years. And they've, they've always done it. When Phil Rizzuto's name was on this thing, he was a, it was a big item and players went. And they still want to help because they know it's a good cause. Right. Scooter was there for many, many years, and you were always there to help Scooter. And now you're taking over since he's gone, and we appreciate what you do. Now, a little bit, talk about the Yankee team of today, the second half. How do you feel? Well, I think we're the best ball club. I think we're going to go ahead and, and uh, prove it. I think we were uh, a shell of what we are now early in the season. I think we're much better than that. We have to share going much better, and naturally we have A-Rod back in there. So... Uh, if those things were, if, if Teixeira had been going real well early and A-Rod was in the lineup, uh, I think we would have been a different ball club. And the pitching has come on now. The pitching is better now than it was. We're leading the league in run scored, and I think we'll continue to be a top run scoring team. You think we need something before the end of the trading deadline of pitching? Well, you, you never know for sure because you don't know about injuries, but it, we're not in much as need as some ball clubs. I think... Uh, our bullpen has come on and shown that it's better than what it was the first three or four weeks. The bullpen has uh, settled down now. Uh, they, the coaching staff has done a good job with that. And I think uh, uh, bringing up Melanson and people around him, uh, if, if Melanson gets his feet on the ground, he'll be a big help. And we have good, successful bullpenners out there right now. With Phil Hughes uh, turning it around with, uh, as a bullpenner, uh, we think we have a good ball club now. Thank you. As always, thank you very much for taking out the time and being there for me and uh, your generosity. We really appreciate it. Glad to do it, Eddie. You know that. Thank you. This is Ed Lucas at Yankee Stadium with Gene Stick Michael, the New York Yankees, for YesNetwork.com, as I say it.